I'm going to talk about the GM Gen 5 T cases, the year differences, and the transmission type differences. So the main difference that's easy to tell off the bat is um, this is where it connects to your transmission. So you'll see these um, output gears. The splines come all the way up. So this design right here, this is a, for a 6L80 transmission. Next, we'll go over to the eight speed. Now we see the splines are recessed quite a bit, almost an inch recessed. Um, this design slightly different. The rest of the T case is identical from a six speed to eight speed, but you need to use a, um, well, a six speed T case would not really fit on an eight speed or 10 speed. But I did have an eight speed T case on my 6L80. They didn't have any issues, but there could be issues. So um, I didn't know about the differences until I got a bunch of T cases in. So that's what you want to look for. You want to check these input gears. Um, now you can see the 10 speed. The 10 speed is much thicker and it has the recessed splines kind of like the 8 speed. They're just not as recessed. And then over here, we got your motor. But there is no speed sensor here for the six speed and eight speeds they have a speed sensor now over here i'm going to turn this one around show you a difference between a like a 3023 t case these are versus the heavy duty t cases you'll have this this range position sensor right here the hd t cases don't need this that's because there's no clutches in them so it's like it just you know locks in high or low almost instantaneous these are all auto t cases meaning you can put your your vehicle in in auto mode and the clutches would engage or disengage when you, you have tire slip so this is a standard t case that comes in like all v6s and v8s with six speeds eight speed and ten speeds in your like 1500 series trucks 2500 um, series and up will have a different T case and it will not have this range position sensor. So just want to go over the, the year ranges on these and the uh, transmission type. That way if you, you're mix matching you know what to look for or else you're going to have a headache. And um, there's some codes on here you know this has an AZB you know, I'm not sure if all 8 speeds have this AZB. Um, this 10 speed is an A, A98, Alpha 98. Um, so, you know how they're doing it, they're always making changes. And then the, that's an 8 speed as well, and that's an APS. So, I thought you can't really go off that tag too well. Just go off the output gear on that or wherever it might be called an input gear, probably input gear on these. So again, we got the 6L80, the 8L90, and the 10L80. So thanks for watching, I hope you learned something.